All of the women were asked the following questions. If your vagina got dressed, what would it wear? Glasses. Mm. A beret. A leather jacket. Silk stockings? Mink. No, not mink. A pink boa. A male tuxedo? Jeans. Something form fitting? Emeralds. A silk evening gown. Sequins. Armani only. A tutu. See through black underwear. A towel for a ball gown. Something machine washable. Costume eye mask, purple velvet pajamas, and Gora, a red bow. Are mine in pearls? A leopard hat, a silk kimono, sweatpants, a tattoo, an electrical shock device. Keep on wanting strangers away. High heels, lace, and combat boots, purple feathers, twigs, and shells, cotton, a pinafore, a bikini, a slicker. If your vagina could talk, what would it say? Two words. Slow, Slow down. down. Is that you? Feed me. <laughs> I want yum, yum. Oh, yeah. Start again. No, over there. Lick me. Stay home. Brave choice. Think again. Embrace me. More please. Let's play. Don't stop. More. More. Remember me? Come inside. Not yet. <laughs> Whoa, mama. <laughs> yes. Yes. <sighs> Rock me. Enter at your own risk. Oh, God. <laughs> Thank God. I'm here. Let's go, let's go. Find me. Thank you, bonjour. Too hard, don't give up. Where's Brian? Uh, uh, that's better. Yes, there, there. The ACLU reports that in 35 states, police officers can use consent as a defense against sexual assault of arrestees while in custody. One in three to four girls is sexually abused in the United States before the age of 18. The majority of incidences occur within the family. 72% of murder suicides involve intimate partners. 94% of victims of these murder suicides are female. And violence against women and girls.